Hey everybody, I'm Mike DiCepoli and welcome to the Heritage Market Minute for February 2nd, 2021. We're going to do something a little bit different this week. We want to talk about a particular news event in the markets. That is the situation surrounding the GameStop stock because we've had a lot of questions and spoken to a few of you individually. So we thought it makes sense to discuss. What you have to understand is a lot of hedge funds and institutions identified GameStop as a failing company and they bet against the company's success by selling short the stock, which means they sell shares they don't own with the hopes of buying them back at a later date at a lower price. That's how they profit. However, the problem being is a little bit of positive news coupled with some exuberance from some online communities and retail investors buying the stock sent GameStop shares much, much higher, which caused big losses for the hedge funds. The problem with these hedge funds is they use leverage and when they start to take on big losses, they are hit with capital requirements. Now we tell you this because we think this was the unintended effect that affected some other areas of the market. So when you get hit with a capital call or a margin requirement, you're forced to sell something. And what we believe is hedge funds did not want to abandon their short bets against GameStop, so they were selling other better performing stocks. That's why we saw some downside action in the market at the end of last week and carried through the weekend. So far, we firmed up this week as the mania has slowed down in stocks like GameStop. Ultimately, we do not think that that is investing. We think that is more gambling because there is no fundamental basis or valuation to support the way these stocks are trading. So we just wanted to talk to you about that. It's a small company, $25 billion market cap. It is not big enough to take down the whole market. We don't see this as a problem. We see this as more as a, of a distraction from what has been a fantastic earnings season so far. So that's on our take on GameStop. We're not getting involved. Uh, fun to watch from afar, but not something we think that will upset the entire market. If you have any questions, reach out to us. We hope you have a great week. See you back next week.